Okay, everybody, I want to talk about this cool program that I found um, on the Kim Commando uh, website. Anyway, she's a real cool, smart, computer, savvy lady that finds fun stuff and gives cool uh, uh, PC tips and stuff like that. She's, she's just a little of everything. Well, she come across this really fun little program and she put it on her website. Thank you, Kim. Anyway, this website is called Drive Software Company, and I will include the link in the description of this video. Anyway, the, the, the um, fun software she was talking about is called Free Desktop Timer. It's freeware, because it's, it says so right here. And if you look, there is some screenshots of the various skins it comes with. It comes with this one, or this one, or this one, or this one. <laughs> and you can download it in uh, a zip format or the EXE format, which I would just go for the EXE because that's what's inside the zip. <laughs> I don't know why they give you two options when it ends up being the same thing in the end. Um... This company also has like uh, other uh, freeware programs that are 100% free, but they also have some shareware as well. Um, I'm not going to get into that just yet. I'm going to talk about this program. So let's take a look at Free Desktop Timer version 1.1. Let's take a look at it because I um, downloaded it and installed it and tried it for a couple days and it's kind of cool. Okay, I'm going to go into start because I have Windows 7, 64-bit, so that means I can do search. I'm going to search for it, and here it is, free desktop timer. And uh, as you can see, right now it's in this um, gray skin. Um, it's got start and reset. Okay, and if you notice, if you kind of slowly move your mouse like this and below it's those are so you can um, make the minutes higher or lower to set you know to set it um, you got the hour minutes and seconds um, if you want it to um, boil some eggs and you're listening to some music and you don't hear the timer on your microwave that's okay because you got this free desktop timer <laughs> Here you go like this, little arrow up here, kind of highlights itself. What's it? What is it? 15 minutes for eggs? Then you get 15 minutes for eggs right here. And then you click on the start button. And it starts counting backwards. Until, and then when the sound goes off, I'm going to show you what the sound sounds like. Um, I got it on the, the uh, Kaku. Um, sound format, which sounds like a bird. I'm going to set the seconds for two seconds here. I'm going to go over into seconds and then start. Oh, never mind. <laughs> and then when you want it to stop, when you want it to stop making that noise, it's reset. I'm sorry, I did not have the bird. I thought I had it on the bird. You can change the sound on it. So anyway, if you right-click on the item, if you just right-click anywhere, you can, up here where it says new timer, you can set as many timers as you want. You can have another new timer. I mean, you can have three things What's going on here? Why is this thing acting wacko? Oh well, it's just going to... Alright. Okay, maybe I don't like that. But anyway, new timer. Okay, sometimes it, it's a little buggy, but hey. Um, you can have three things going. You see three timers. And you can have your potatoes cooking, your rose cooking, your carrots cooking. You just don't know. And over here, if you just move your mouse a little bit, you'll see the X. And you can close each one. There's no X, and you can close that one, but I'm not going to do that. Okay, now skins. 
Right now I have it on gray. There's black, glass, two, um, glass, and then LCD red and green and small and LCD. I kind of like, um, there's black. And then, I kind of like that one. I kind of like this black. And then there's glass. I'm not sure if that's going to show up in this um, screen recording because I'm using BB flashback and it's a little buggy. So let's try, let's try glass. There's glass. So what the skin looks like for this um, timer. And if I right click again, skins, and then glass two. I like glass two because it's the biggest and the brightest and stuff. And if you slowly move your mouse, you see the arrows. And over here, you see the X. You can close the program. And you can set hours and minutes and seconds, like I said before. And if you want to stop it short, you just click reset over here. You know what I mean? So it's like, it's a pretty cool program. So, okay, let's go sounds. Um, you hear that? Let's click another sound. You can change the sound. Kaku. And then you can, uh, the normal beep shit. I like the beep. The beep's okay. The kaku is kind of funny and stuff like that. So we got that. Did I just talk about all this shit? <laughs> but anyway, that was a free desktop timer and it's pretty cool. And so now you can have a timer for your computer in case you don't hear the timer on your microwave because you're playing loud music. That's the only reason why I like this little program. It's really cool.